Today, I'm using House Call Pro. Are you still using pen and paper to get your paperwork done? To take your customer's phone numbers? The job information? You gotta check out House Call Pro. It is a great app. Everything at the fingertips of your phone. It's a great service app for a small business like myself. Paperless. Send your text to the job via the app. Start the job via the app while letting the customer know that the job has started. Of course, completing the job and the best part of all, payment. It's a game changer, folks. Paperless is the way to go. Check out the link below, housecallpro.com forward slash Chuck Barron. Set up your free demo. And if you sign up, your first month is 19 bucks. You can't beat it, folks. Check it out. We'll see you inside. Shut this off. Boop. We're going to put in 10 gallons of antifreeze in here. Five or 10 gallons. Out of the system. And then we're going to pump it back in when CB2 gets here. That's his job. CB2 is with us today. It's been a while. How do you feel? Really good. Are you ready? It's early. You ready? To... Turn that light on so we can get some light on the sub deck. Ah, look at this. We got to pop the whole lid off. Ah. Don't spill it. No, no, look, because the pump goes in like so. Uh, that's, oh, why, that's why I had to take a little. All right, hook that up to that board right down there. Just tighten that on there and open up that board drain. We're going to pump this right in the system. close it because it might back pressure on us.
it. He'll get it. All right. Can I call you back? I got I got CBT working. You got it. All right. I'll show you. <laughs> yeah. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Being soft right now. Being soft, Brian. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, come on, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Alright, start we gotta get the whole five gallons in there. Let's do it. <laughs> Jesus Christmas. Pretend you're pumping the keg, you know? <laughs> keg comes out easier than this. <laughs> it's under pressure, that's why. Oh my god. <laughs> Good job, Chop. You only got a quarter bucket done. Come on, let me pump some. You want me to pump some? Yeah, hop in. Come on, man. Give me your raw power if you're bragging about. My, my 54 year old power? Come on, dude. What'd you call me today? You called me a boomer. Come on. This is how it's done. If any of you plumbers out there have an easier way than to do this, let me know, because this is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you, this fourth pump is really low. Okay. Works for me? Yeah. Works good? Works good. Works good. Let me make sure it's all the way open. Which I know it is. This is just a warm off. Yeah. When CB2 is happy, CB1 is happy. things back together here I wanted the extra off on the antifreeze because I got some two inch mains here top and bottom five radiators one two upstairs small ones and then three three big boys so I want the extra yard on the antifreeze and uh, I'm gonna take a sample because I'm a freak I really don't do this much 
but I'm gonna put it in a bottle and freeze it and see what happens. Just to double check. We get it done. Oh uh, yeah. Pump the seeds for the boys. <laughs> it was the most conventional way. I don't really do that. If you guys can recommend an easier way to pump in some antifreeze in a boiler, that force pump, I'm telling you, is 25 years old. It's probably been used 10 times in its career. And Chucky was falling apart on me. So we went with the force pump, and it worked. But there's got to be a better way. In the end, we got it done, and we will see you at the next one. Have a great day.